Hi, in this video I will show how to use CSV to MT940 uh, converting into it. So this is my website. To find app, I will type, I will click in search and type MT940, and we need this one CSV to MT940 converter. I'll click on it. Click on download to start the loading process and wait until the file will be uploaded. So MT940 is bank statement format. It usually contains uh, information about a bank transaction. And it's um, it's stored in like semi-textual way. So in order to create this, we, we will use I will use CSV file with bank transaction in it, and it will transform it to so you can see archive has been downloaded and click on downloaded archive, double click on MSI to start the installation, click on more info here. I'm getting this screen from Windows because I'm not registered publisher with Microsoft, so I will just click run anyway to start the installation, click on next, next install, click on yes on this screen, click on finish on final screen. And you can see app has been installed on my computer, I have a new shortcut on my desktop, now I can and double click on shortcut to launch app. Now conversion is three steps process. In first step I have to select input file. <coughs> I have a I have a CSV file with bank transaction. I can show you what is inside of the CSV file. Actually this one. So I have a CSV viewer, it's another app. I I will leave link on this app in the description. It's free app. And it's showing what's inside in CSV. And you can see like there is a transaction description, transaction date, value date, entry date, funds, code, amount, transaction reference, relation, debit, credit, and so on. So there is another like information here, but we mainly will be using this transaction script. So first step is to select input file. I'll click on select input file and navigate to my uh, The CSV folder, standard bank transaction CSV, and click on this. I also can download input file example if you don't have a, uh, if you don't know what will be uh, like how CSV file will go like this transaction. So it's, you can click on this and you will download an uh, example of this. Basically, this file will be downloaded. So click on next step. Here is um, information has to specify about my account, so my account number, currency, owner name, opening balance, credit debit, and all of this will be placed into MT940 file, because if CSV is not carrying this information, usually CSV may have only transaction information. Information about account should be entered here, and here is mapping. What Mapping on left side we see all columns for MT940. On the right side we see all columns from our CSV file. So I'll just click and select transaction value date, transaction entry date, and debit credit, transaction debit credit, currency. Currency is a transaction currency chart for a specific transaction. There is a one character that represents currency. We have to specified because I could have a different transactions in different currencies. Amount is amount folder, transaction amount, description, transaction description, code, uh, transaction funds code, and type, transaction type, sequence number, transaction reference, and title I don't have a title for this, but in my CC, but let's use transaction reference as a title. Transaction reference. And yeah. And also I have to specify closing uh, balance and date because it's not it could be not in a, in a CC file. So for this account. And I click on next step, click on run to create uh, 
1940 file, it's usually txt file, so just save it. And I have a MT940 viewer installed on my machine. It's another free app, but I can show you how MT940 look like. Let's see it. Let's open it with um, Notepad. And you can see it has all 86 records. So basically everything about transactions, 86 records. And uh, start in this way, begin, header all like um, the numbers are type of transactions but I have a viewer to show it in more presentable way so I'll go and open this file in viewer and you can see it has transaction description, transaction value, transaction date, month, everything converted from CSV into MT940. So basically that's it. If you have any questions please leave them in comments. Thank you.